Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in which you partake of Christ, His, his sufferings, sufferings are remembered, remembered. Our, our minds, minds are filled, filled with His grace, and we receive, receive the, the pledge of the glory which is to be ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food. And this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you, you gave us the Eucharist as the memorial of your suffering and death. May our worship of this sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you won for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, And she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done to me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh. And dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, o Holy Mother of God. That we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. For forth we, we beseech, beseech you, O Lord, Lord your, your grace into our hearts, hearts that, that we, to whom, whom the incarnation of Christ, Christ your Son, was made known by the message of an angel, made by his passion and cross, be brought to the glory of his resurrection, resurrection through the same Christ, Christ our, our Lord. Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Joyful Mysteries The first mystery is the Annunciation. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second joyful mystery is the visitation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The third joyful mystery is the birth of Christ. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth joyful mystery is the presentation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fifth joyful mystery is the finding of the child Jesus in the temple. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. 
and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O Holy, Holy Mother, Mother of God, God despite not our petitions and our necessities, our necessities but deliver us from all dangers, O ever glorious and blessed Virgin. Virgin. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, pray for us, that we may be worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, grant we beseech you that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary, of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Behold the faithful and prudent steward, whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed him with his splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, you, you entrusted, entrusted our, our Savior, Savior to, to the, the care, care of St. Joseph. By, by the help of his prayers, may our church continue to serve her Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Jubilee Prayer. O God, our Father and Creator, in, in whom we live and move and have our being, we, we praise you. As we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this jubilee of the Dominican province of the Philippines, O God, the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we preach you as the way, the truth, and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose love we strive to incarnate. O God, the Holy Spirit, Advocate and Guide, we bless you and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works, in the consecration of our lives to holy preaching, in speaking only to you and about you. Let our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all in the gospel we share with all peoples. By your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, 
Pray for us. Our Holy Father, St. Dominic. Pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please be seated for a while. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. Today is the feast day of St. James Apostle. St. James, son of Zebedee, and brother of St. John the Apostle, was born at Bethsaida. He was present at most of the miracles performed by Christ and was put to death by Herod around the year 42. He is specially honored at Compostela in Spain, where a famous church is dedicated to his name. We will now have the morning prayer of the church, integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and, and my, my mouth, mouth shall declare, declare your praise. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Come, let us sing to the Lord, and shout with joy to the rock who saves us. Let us approach Him with praise and thanksgiving, and sing joyful songs to the Lord. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in His hands the depths of the earth, and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea, it belongs to Him. The dry land too, for it was formed by his hands. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Come then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For he is our God, and we are his people, the flock he shepherds. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Today listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness. When at Meribah and Massa, they challenged me and provoked me although they had seen all of my works. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Forty years I endured that generation. I said, they are a people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger, they shall not enter into my rest. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Please be seated. As he was walking along, Jesus saw James, the son of Zebedee, and his brother John, and he called them. O God, you are my God, for you I long. For you my soul is thirsting. My body pines for you, like a dry weary land without water. So I gaze on you in the sanctuary to see your strength and your glory. For your love is better than life. My lips will speak your praise. So I will bless you all my life. In your name, I will lift up my hand. My soul shall be filled as with a banquet. My mouth shall praise you with joy. On my bed, I remember you. On you, I muse through the night. For you have been my help. In the shadow of your wings, I rejoice. My soul clings to you. Your right hand holds me fast. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Immediately, they left their nets and their father and followed him. Bless the Lord, all you works of the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Angels of the Lord, bless the Lord. You heavens, bless the Lord. All you waters above the heavens, bless the Lord. All you hosts of the Lord, bless the Lord. Sun and moon, bless the Lord. Stars and heavens, bless the Lord. Every shower and dew, bless the Lord. All you winds, bless the Lord. Fire and heat, bless the Lord. Cold and chill, bless the Lord. Dew and rain, bless the Lord. Frost and chill, bless the Lord. Ice and snow, bless the Lord. Nights and days, bless the Lord. Light and darkness, bless the Lord. Lightnings and clouds, bless the Lord. Let the earth bless the Lord. 
praise and exalt him above all forever. Mountains and hills, bless the Lord. Everything growing from the earth, bless the Lord. You springs, bless the Lord. Seas and rivers, bless the Lord. You dolphins and all water creatures, bless the Lord. All you birds of the air, bless the Lord. All you beasts, wild and tame, bless the Lord. You sons of men, bless the Lord. O Israel, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Priest of the Lord, bless the Lord. Servants of the Lord, bless the Lord. Spirits and souls of the just, bless the Lord. Holy men of humble heart, bless the Lord. Hananiah, Azariah, Mishael, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Let us bless the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Let us praise and exalt him above all forever. Blessed are you, Lord, in the firmament of heaven. Praiseworthy and glorious and exalted above all forever. You shall drink from the cup that I shall drink. From you shall be baptized as I am baptized. Sing a new song to the Lord, his praise in the assembly of the faithful. Let Israel rejoice in its maker. Let Zion's son exult in their king. Let them praise his name with dancing and make music with timbrel and harp. For the Lord takes delight in his people. He crowns the poor with salvation. Let the faithful rejoice in their glory, shout for joy and take their rest. Let the praise of God be on their lips and a two-edged sword in their hand. To deal out vengeance to the nations and punishment on all the peoples, to bind their kings in chains and their nobles in fetters of fire, to carry out the sentence preordained, this honor is for all his faithful. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. Let us pray. <clears throat> Almighty and ever-living God, who consecrated the first fruits of your apostles, by the blood of St. James, grant, we pray, that your church may be strengthened by his confession of faith and constantly sustained by his protection. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the second letter of St. Paul, to the Corinthians. Brothers and sisters, we hold this treasure in earthen vessels that the surpassing power may be of God and not of us. We are afflicted in every way, but not constrained, perplexed, but not driven to despair, persecuted, but not abandoned, struck down, but not destroyed always carrying about in the body the dying of Jesus, so that the life of Jesus may also be manifested in our body. For we who live are constantly being given up to death for the sake of Jesus, so that the life of Jesus may be manifested in our mortal flesh. So death is at work in us, but life in you. Since then, we have the same spirit of faith, according to what is written, I believe, therefore I spoke. We too believed and therefore speak, knowing that the one who raised the Lord Jesus will raise us also with Jesus and place us with you in his presence. Everything indeed is for you so that the grace bestowed in abundance on more and more people may cause the thanksgiving to overflow for the glory of God. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Those who sow in tears shall reap rejoicing. Those who sow in tears shall reap rejoicing. When the Lord brought back the captives of Zion, we were like men dreaming. Then our mouth was filled with laughter, and our tongue with rejoicing. Those who saw in tears shall reap rejoicing. Then they said among the nations, The Lord has done great things for them. The Lord has done great things for us. We are glad indeed. Those who saw in tears shall reap rejoicing. 
Restore our fortunes, O Lord, like the torrents in the southern desert. Those that sow in tears shall reap rejoicing. Those who sow in tears shall reap rejoicing. Although they go forth weeping, carrying the seed to be sown, they shall come back rejoicing, carrying their sheaves. Those who sow in tears shall reap rejoicing. Please stand. I chose you from the world to go and bear fruit that will last, says the Lord. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. The mother of the sons of Zebedee approached Jesus with her sons and did him homage, wishing to ask him for something. He said to her, What do you wish? He answered, Command that these two sons of mine sit, one at your right, the other at your left, in your kingdom. Jesus said in reply, You do not know what you are asking. Can you drink the chalice that I am going to drink? They said to him, We can. He replied, My chalice you will indeed drink. But to sit at my right and at my left, this is not mine to give, but is for those for whom it has been prepared by my Father. When the ten heard this, they became indignant at the two brothers. But Jesus summoned them and said, You know that the rulers of the Gentiles lord it over them, and the great ones make their authority over them felt but it shall not be so among you. Rather, whoever wishes to be great among you shall be your servant. Whoever wishes to be first among you shall be your slave. Just so, the Son of Man did not come to be served, but to serve and to give his life as ransom for many. My brothers and sisters, the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Mga kapatid, ngayon po ay kapistahan ng isang dakilang apostol ng ating Santa Iglesia, isa sa mga pinakatampok at taniyag na tagasunod ng ating Panginoon na si Santiago Apostol. Ngunit ang ating binasang Ibanghelyo, ang pinakapangunahing tauhan bukod kay Jesus ay hindi si Santiago kundi ang kanyang ina. At mga kapatid, kung babasahin natin ang Ibanghelyo, susanda nating mabuti ang kwento ng ating Ibanghelyo ngayong araw, makikita natin na ang nanay ni Santiago at ni Juan, mayroon ding ambisyon, mayroong pangarap para sa kanyang mga anak. Ngunit wag natin siyang husgahan kung siya ay ambisyosa at may pangarap. Sapagkat sa mga magulang dito, Sino po ba rito ang magulang na walang ambisyon at walang pangarap para sa kanilang mga anak? Marahil nga, ang mga magulang na narito ngayon ay pumunta dito sa dambana ng mahal na ina, humihingi ng milagro, 
hindi lamang para sa kanilang sarili, kundi lalong-lalo na para sa kanilang mga pamilya, para sa kanilang mga anak. Ngunit mga kapatid, itong kwento ng Ibanghelyong ito, itong talata ng, talatang ito ng Ibanghelyo ay kinikwento sa atin para tayo ay palalahanan at para tayo ay hamunin na suriin ang ating mga ambisyon at mga pangarap. Bukod sa pangangarap para sa ating mga sarili, bukod sa pagkakaroon ng ambisyon para sa ating mga sarili, hinahamon tayo ng Ibanghelyo ngayon para tanungin, para suriin. Ito ang ating mga pangarap, ito ang ating mga ambisyon sa buhay. Ngunit, ano ba ang kagustuhan ng Diyos para sa atin? Ito ang pangarap natin. Ito ang ambisyon natin para sa ating mga anak, para sa ating mga sarili. But, what is the will of the Lord? What is God's will for us? Madali lang naman ang sagot diyan. Ang sabi ni Santa Teresa, Santa Teresa ng Calcutta, Mother Teresa of Calcutta, God calls us not to be successful, but to be faithful. God calls us not to be successful, but to be faithful. Tinatawag tayo ng Diyos, hindi para magkaroon ng maraming diplomang isasabit sa ating mga sala. Ano? Tinatawag tayo ng Diyos, hindi para magkaroon ng napakaraming titulo. Doktor, attorney, honorable. Tinatawag tayo ng Diyos, hindi para magkaroon ng maraming pera sa bangko. Tinatawag tayo ng Diyos para maging tapat sa kanyang kalooban. At yun ang hamon sa atin. Ang tuklasin, ang diskubrihin kung ano ang kalooban ng Diyos para sa atin at maging tapat doon. Alam po ninyo mga kapatid, kami mga pari, may dalawang pinaka-iniingat-ingatang mga bagay mula sa aming ordinasyon. Noong kami ordinasyon, noong kami gawing pari, ordinahan ba ordinahan para maging pari. <clears throat> Pinahiran ng obispo ang aming mga kamay ng krisma, isang uri ng lana, isang uri ng oil na mabangong mabango. Ito ay tanda na ang aming mga kamay kapag ginamit namin sa pagbabasbas, ang binabasbasan namin ay nagiging banal nagiging alay sa Diyos. At noong ang obispo ay lagyan ng oil, lana ng aming mga kamay, pinahiran ito ng isang kapirasong tela. At isa ito sa aming mga pinakaingat-ingatan, sapagkat kapag namatay ang aming nanay, ilalagay ito sa kanyang mga kamay para pagdating niya sa langit, ipapakita niya ito sa Diyos at sasabihin sa Diyos, Panginoon, mayroon po akong anak na pari at siya po ay aking alay sa inyo. Ang isa sa aming pinakaingat-ingatang bagay ay yung pinakaunang stola na ginamit namin sa pangungumpisal. Ito po yung stola. Yung kapirasong tela na sinusot ng pari kapag siya ay nagbiministeryo. At ang unang stola na ginamit namin sa pinakaunang sakramento ng kumpisal na aming ginawa ay inilalagay din namin sa kamay ng aming mga tatay kapag sila ay namatay. At kapag harap nila sa Diyos, ipapakita nila ito sa Diyos at sasabihin, Panginoon, mayroon po kong anak na pari at siya ay aking alay sa inyo. At nananampalataya kami na kapag ipinakita ng aming nanay at ng aming tatay ang mga bagay na ito, sila yayakapin ng Diyos at patutuloyin sa langit. Ngunit mga kapatid, ang mga bagay na ito ay walang silbi, walang kwenta, walang halaga kapag kaming mga pari ay hindi naging tapat. 
Ano itong kapirasong tela na ito na ipapakita ng aming nanay at tatay sa Diyos? Kung kami naman na ay paring salbahe, paring babaero, paring nagnakaw sa simbahan, paring hindi naging tapat. Ngunit hindi lamang po kami mga pari ang maaring gumawa na ito. Kung kayo po ay naging tapat, tapat na doktor, maaari ninyong ibigay sa inyong nanay ang inyong stethoscope at pagharap nila sa Diyos, maaari nila itong ipakita sa Diyos at sasabihin, Panginoon, mayroon akong anak na doktor na naglingkod ng tapat sa kanyang kapwa at naniniwala akong yayakapin rin sila ng Diyos at patutuloyin sa langit. Kapag kayo ay tapat na janitor, tapat na gwardya, iniaalay ang inyong buhay sa serbisyo ng may katapatan at kababaang loob, maaari ninyong ibigay sa Panginoon ang inyong walis. Maaari ninyong ibigay sa inyong mga magulang ang inyong walis, ang inyong batuta, ang inyong gamit sa paglilingkod. At pagharap ng inyong mag- mga magulang sa ating Panginoon, maaari rin nilang sabihin, Panginoon, nagkaroon ako ng anak na tapat na naglingkod sa kapwa at sa inyo. Mga kapatid, tayo ay tinatawag ng Diyos hindi para maging mayaman. Tayo'y tinatawag ng Diyos, hindi para maging tanyag at tampok sa lipunan. Tayo'y tinatawag ng Diyos, hindi para maging makapangyarihan sa ating bayan. Tayo'y tinatawag ng Diyos na maging tapat sa Kanya, maging tapat sa ating kapwa, sa ating paglilingkod. God calls us not to be successful, but to be faithful. Magsitayo tayong lahat at ialay ang ating panalangin. James, the brother of John, was called from mending his fishing nets to follow Christ. Assisted by the apostles who learned to serve others, let us make our prayers. Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. That servants of the church may perform their ministry in spirit of service and commitment. Let us pray to the Lord. That those holding public office may perform their task with integrity and dedication. Let us pray to the Lord. That there may be many young people who will generously respond to the call to the priestly and consecrated life. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our that the sick may learn to share the cup of Christ's suffering. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord For our Pope, the College of Bishops, parents, relatives, benefactors, and for all those who we promise to pray, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for the Master of the Order and his assistants, and for our brothers and ministry at Santo Domingo, and Our Lady of the Rosary. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear. For the intentions of the devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, and for our personal intentions. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear. That our departed loved ones may be welcomed into the joy of God's kingdom. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear. God, loving Father, we bring before you our petitions through the prayers of Our Lady of the Rosary and of St. James. We ask you to hear us in your graciousness and help us to become your true disciples. This we ask in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Please be seated.
Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth, work of human hands, it will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine, work of human hands, it will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, my brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of His all His holy church. Cleanse us, Lord, by the saving baptism of your Son's passion, so that on the feast of St. James, whom you willed to be the first among the apostles, to drink of Christ's chalice of suffering, we may offer a sacrifice pleasing to you through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It, it is, is right, right and just. just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, to praise your mighty deeds and the exaltation of all your saints. For you are the eternal shepherd, for you, eternal shepherd, do not desert your flock, but through the blessed apostles, watch over it and protect it always, so that it may be governed by those you have appointed shepherds to lead it in the name of your Son. And so with angels and archangels, with thrones and dominions, and with all the hosts and powers of heaven, we sing the hymn of your glory as without end we acclaim. Please kneel. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and, giving thanks, broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice. And once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, 
the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The Mystery of Faith Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis our Pope and Socrates our Bishop and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, the Mother of God, with Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse, with the blessed apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen, amen, amen. Please all stand. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin, 
and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and glory are yours now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Please heal. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am ready that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word and my soul shall be healed. Please stand. Jesus took Peter, James, and his brother John and led them up a high mountain where they could be alone. And he was transfigured before them. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant, David. Through his holy prophets, he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, 
for we go before the Lord to prepare His way, to give His people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Jesus took Peter, James, and his brother John, and led them up a high mountain where they could be alone. And he was transfigured before them. Let us pray. Help us, O Lord, we pray, through the intercession of the blessed Apostle James. On whose feast day, we have received with joy your holy gifts. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Eucharist is offered. Go in the peace of Christ. Thanks be to God. Babasbasan po natin ngayon ang inyong mga religious articles at ang mga kapatid nating may sakit. Let us pray. God, our Almighty Father, by your blessing, you give us strength and support in our frailty. Turn with kindness toward our sick brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness and restore them to good health through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, they will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Blessing of Religious Articles In memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, and to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, may these rosaries, images, candles, oils, and other articles of devotion be blessed and made holy in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.